Hey, listen to what the Apostle Paul says to a church a long time ago. 1 Corinthians 5, 14, For Christ's love compels us, because we are convinced that one died for all, and therefore all died. He died for, for all of us that we should live no longer for ourselves, but for him who died. And then a couple verses later, he says, If anyone is in Christ, which is you and me, right? He says, If anyone is in Christ, the new creation has come. The old is gone. The new is here. And what I'm really excited about is you're checking out this video because God's put somebody on your heart. You shared with our church your one, their name, maybe some information, and now you're here to learn a little bit about how to help your one find Jesus because this new life, this new creation that I am, that you are, you want to share that with someone else. And, and so I just want to give an overview of how we do that together here at Christ Church. And then there are a, a couple other videos that will follow this, getting into more of the specifics. But your one is just someone that you care about who's outside of Jesus. He's not following him. He's not connected to his family. And you see what God is doing in your life. And you want that for someone else. That's what makes somebody a one. They're, they're just someone's face you recognize and care about in, in one of the myriad of places you go. Maybe there are even more ones to consider out there. And as you want to share with them, at, at Christ Church, we've been using a 3D one approach to evangelism of introducing our ones to Jesus. And the, the Ds are this, develop friendship, discover stories, and discern next steps. And so the videos to follow just unpack what does it mean to develop friendships? It's just how we build trust with people, whether they're really close to us and they're, they're new friendship or, or existing friendships or new ones, we can build more trust. Discovering stories is how we build empathy and get to know each other and hear someone's journey. And discerning next steps is where we, in prayer, go to the Holy Spirit and, and, and figure out what, what's best for this particular situation, this one person. And here's what I know, is the Holy Spirit that resides in me and in you, it's all we need. You may feel like you don't know enough, you don't have what you need, but you have God's Holy Spirit living in you, then you have everything you need to tell someone about God. And so we're gonna help each other with this journey of sharing with our ones. So please check out the other videos that are a part of this series, unpacking these three Ds so that God can use you and use me to help our ones find him.